in a crowd. It comes from the silence and displays and wisdom. My brother, Chief Gerard, this is your evening. And even chosen to honor you that day, you are 64 years old. So I cannot longer tell Pius Anu that I'm older than him. I'm so quiet with him. So it's okay, no matter that um, I share the same age bracket with him. But you have exposed me beyond what I should have. Am I proud to have you as a senior brother? Yes, but if destiny could be changed, I would have loved to be a senior brother. <laughs> when I became the governor of Imo State, in the struggle of seniority, my brother quickly announced and declared himself Apex, and the whole Imo people crowned him Apex. So in other words, to be from the governor, he's still the Apex. <laughs> And we often make jokes, and he says to me, he's a senior brother to the governor of Imo State. And I disagree. That a senior brother, governor does not have a senior brother. Nobody can be older than the governor. But somebody can be older than Rochester already. So we had this issue going on for a long time, until we settled. But my brother, Gerard, I want to salute you. And let me tell the dignities that are here to honor you. As a phone call for what we call a surprise birthday, I called the former senior president, Secretary of Government, a barrister, a learned man, a man of uh, timber and caliber, a man of wisdom. I called him about 2 o'clock. I said, I have a dinner and I have a surprise birthday for my brother. He said to me, I'll be there with you. My brother, Paris Anil, distinguished senator of the Federal Republic, senate president, former state government, thank you for honoring me. This is a display of brotherhood, a display of uh, friendship. I called Ken at about 5 o'clock, and 4 o'clock at about. A former senate president, number three citizens of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, one time. And I called him, he said, Count me in and be there. Please go out here to honor me. Ken, my brother, the civil senator, God bless you for honoring me and honoring my brother. Then I met my son, my political son, <coughs> who took me several days as honorable member. That's the way of conspiring that they're going to impeach me. And, and they will go and meet their child and my wife. And they will, they, will, they will crook and crook and collect money from them. So, you know, no, 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 not to. But what did I say to him? You see, this, this, you are, I say it was one of such radicals in the House of Assembly, and they respect him so much. And an old member. I say, do you know, I see, I, I have a dream that one day you will make it politically in life. Because the day you were born, there was a crisis in hell. And he made it to the Senate, surprising. And he almost made it to the governor, if not the Nigeria equation. But today, we are proud to have him as the National Secretary of the PDP. He's a man that knows how to survive in any trouble water. And I want to commend you with your team that I've come with you. Just know that uh, we're in partnership anytime. Thank you for honoring my brother. And um, this thing is, ladies and gentlemen, I have some of my friends from the, from Sri Lanka, from Bauchiga, from China, the Sayyidian, and uh, NS, and all of you who are partners. Uh, thank you for coming. And I've seen Madame has invited all her friends, her twins, to the former, the wife of the former governor of uh, Nassau State, and the, former, the wife of the former secretary to government of Nassau State. And, the, and all of them, the women did that say, end of this city, all of them, they're here. And some of my friends here, um, and my partners in progress, one of the outstanding Bennett man, uh, Allah, many of them is here. Um, we'll give you your case, just go home and sleep. Uh, the man has law, 
at the tips of his fingers. I don't know who I want to welcome you. And I have one litigator here. Uh, by Sobajay. Always litigating. He does nothing. He's rice in the morning, he's lunch, he's dinner, he's litigation. Obajay, I'm I will look for more trouble, so I'm going to call you. And I want to welcome all my beautiful ladies from the north. All of them, they always come uh, through Hanan and all my staff, they've always been around us and they're here to honor you. But let me say to all of you, my brother has just been made a chief by this out of this city. And in good tradition, a chief can marry more than one wife. <laughs> so before you leave this evening, my brother has to take a look at all of you. And whoever is lucky to have him as a strong wife is here by a dog that smiling. <laughs> and you see, my, I'm making this speech. My brother never laughed. This one I'm making <laughs> And we'll find a coup to make his wife jealous. So whatever Gideon will do here, what if I go to dance with him, just hold him properly. <laughs> so we can send the video to his house, to wife at home. Then she will call me this night. They say, Uncle, oh, what are you doing to me? But you know, sometimes it's good to spice the, the relationship by introducing somebody from a far distance. So the wife may see her and not touch her. Sometimes it helps in the relationship, and my wife can get me with this. My wife, my wife. <laughs> Now, I want to appreciate my son's here. And I want to introduce all of you one by one. All the first from the eldest son of America, Hosea. Hosea is the son of Joseph, among the presenting the grandchildren. Isaac. Isaac, Isaac here. Yeah. Isaac used to make his hair. He's just 16 years old, but uh, thank God he's graduating in Nigeria. We have recovered this one from America. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, welcome. Hosea. Hosea is also about 15 years old, son of Jude. But you see, he's there. No one, he will die. We shall come back here. And then, uh, uh, Joseph has spoken. And then, uh, my the son of my. Chagose. Chagose is my our, our sister's son. These boys are making us proud. The story you hear about young men in Abuja, these guys don't do it. We're very proud of you. Proud of you. Then, we have one man that will flew in this. The surprise for him, my brother is crazy, wasn't to invite the government to this, but to invite those that he spent his daily hours with. One of them is here. Only, I will take a chief. This guy come back for the convention. He flew in, it was a surprise. So we put him in the hotel, there are two of them. When he saw them, he, he, he was almost collapsed. <laughs> These are the people that keep him busy on daily business. Keep that relationship on. To all of you, my staff, Precious and Precious staff, may you all stand. Please don't stand for Precious and Precious and Precious and Oh, this one is a military man. He's a, he's a, he went to the army and um, something happened. Oh, he's a very good boy. Uh, he's a okay son. We're actually, we're nine in the family, right? Three, three girls, six boys from my mother. And I happen to be the top in the family. These are the grandchildren. Eh? These are the grandchildren. This one is uh, very tough. I'm very hard working boy. Um, last, last week, they got married. They had more than 100 women chasing him on the house. But one was wise to dive in quickly without putting it off. And that was our wife. We put it on the When they speak here, it's also a CD. I don't know what it takes to bring these people. Usually, you're supposed to book them two weeks in advance and then send some 10 million naira, just set for flights. Even if they're coming from Asoko to Matama, you tell them they should flight tickets. But you know, Ken, I won't give you 5 million. Neither will you give you 10 million naira because my brothers. That's what I get from having brothers. And uh, this, is the, this is my dear friend. Um, so for anybody who 
Oh, who thinks you can be my girlfriend? This one has covered both girlfriend and wife. But that's the reason. That's, 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 that she should take one and leave one. <laughs> uh, so I want to take you, my wife, and can I give you this microphone? To appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah. And then I will just walk in, by the sitting, to just say a word. But it was so beautiful. And there's a universe. And this one demands that a, a, a senator cannot leave. Hey! Listen, man. Hey, son. And then the senator cannot leave when the senate president is sitting. And you should be listening about that. Or the government will come for your head. <laughs> Thank you, my son. <laughs> As I was the one time Senate President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, one time Secretary of the Federal Government, my senior father, the man that my family loves so very much, as I was the they said this senator by his eye. As I see one of the man and the Yubo Nation is very proud of one time Senate President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Today you are here because of the very strong relationship I have with my husband, by extension, my family, the Senator Dr. Namani. Thank you, sir. It's an honor to have you here. The single Senator Samdadi and your Hector Raj. My own son and your SMS will be about your also. I also saw one of our son, Honorable, we call him the cause. I'm not sure you are there. It's good that you're here to go and do what you do. Don't forget my DIG, I forgot. The DIG, you are a lovely wife. Commissioners of the rescue mission of my dear husband from 2011 to 2015. I've seen one time commission for winners. Uh, our own barrister, friends of my husband that I gathered here. Of course, the man that we are celebrating today, a man that is my brother in law, but now thought to be my father in law. I really do love him. Um, Oftentimes, my husband and his younger brother and other siblings, particularly children, they will gather and they are so jealous about the love that I share with this great man. The man that ensures that the family of Korosha is tight. The man of peace. The man that I'm proud to say that he's my father in law. Because by every standard, he has proved to be a man that is worthy of holding to the United Nations University. Today, it is a privilege that we all are gathered here to celebrate a man as a body of celebration, a man of love, a man of peace, a man that is representing the entire Okorosha family very well. My husband don't need to go to Ubuku or Jina to start because we have a pillar that is standing like a pillar. Today, I honor you. Today, I celebrate you. You are 64 today, but I know that you will get to 80, you will get to 90, you will get to 100, and by the grace of God, you get to 120. And you know why it is possible? Because of your heart. You know, usually, you and your siblings, especially Barrister Jude and Rogers, you know I'm always watching. But through this evening, I will deem my searchlight. Because you are free. You are not too free. <laughs> Happy birthday. I love you. And my God will keep you alive when you die of your shock family. God bless you. Thank you very much. Now the hour has come, the hour that we are waiting for. Just before our very distinguished guest, we would like to invite the sudden breath. But because he's a man of culture, we, he cannot just stand up to cut the cake, he must be lifted. So, Your Excellency is very distinguished guest as we lift the apex. Thank you, Your Excellency. Thank you, Your Excellency. Nice, that
because kids with you are able kids with you can we please have you to go back to the world let's have a seat can we have you stand by thank you and of course this will not be complete we don't have uh, cheap money I want to care and uh, I can you please Commissioner for Finance welcome and Barista can you please have a call Thank you so very much. Can we please have Barista Chidi Loy? Barista Chidi, please. Barista Chidi, we are waiting for you, sir. Barista Chidi, we are waiting for you, sir. Barista Chidi. What's up? Okay.
opportunity. I have never had with you. You shall be here. Bring up something that's very unique, very primitive, very ingenious, and indeed you must learn from it. And I said, I have had series of interactions with him. And uh, if I count them, we won't go. But I'll mention one. In 2002, yes. I was president of the Senate, and he wanted to open his office, to commission his office in Owari. So he invited me to come and commission the office. So because I was coming, Achike had to accompany me because it was the governor of Humo State then. So after commissioning the office, I tried to bring two of them together because it was a longer heads with Achike. Yes, no way, Hennessy. Oh, what more I chicken? No way, Hennessy. You have to watch a chicken. I think I put your child. Oh, my God. I'm not a man of Cocha or to your brocha. I don't know brocha who don't I want to say that. Your decision to celebrate your senior brother today is challenging to all of us. It's, it's, and I must confess that, apart from that decision, the testimonies of your of your, your own children, you know, your entire family, pouring this love, honor, you know, praise onto your senior brother. My brother. <laughs> I told the senator, I said, look, he is the senior brother, maybe by accident or not. But because your parents are no more now, he's now your father. Yes. I want to congratulate you for bringing up Roger as well. I am sure that this is your father. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes. Congratulations. Yes. And uh, I am sure that uh, you are touched by this very little. And we share the moment with you. The Lord who brought you this far will continue to keep you, not only for your sake, for the sake of the future kindness. You can realize by today that you are not just an ordinary person. Yes. You mean so much to that family. Yes. The Almighty who brought you this far grant you peace, good health, Amen. fulfillment, Amen. happiness Amen. in the many years ahead. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. That was a lot of much that you have put together by the way. This is what comes out. The chairman of our group. And uh, the chairman of our group. No, I mean by our group. The group for the welfare of the world. Please welcome. Said okay. No matter. Um, I will start by just congratulating the apex. The last speaker, Mr. Mr. Tokoy Zion, the smoker that we have. We are here now. There is no competition. We are collaborating. They have said almost everything any other person would have said. And uh, the only thing I would like to add is that we will check family. He said, I sat there listening to the young people, the future coaches, and even the current ones, your in laws and your wives and friends and so on. It seems to me that uh, not many families will do what we witnessed tonight. So it's a thing of joy, as I am pointed out, it's a challenge to many, many families. Even if you are not as accepted outside, but you are accepted in your home. Yes, sir. And yes. 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 So I have more respect for you from this night and being honest with you. That's right. I congratulate you and the part of the family to whom much is given. You are already playing the role, now you have to keep it up. You listen to every person. 
Bahia, Bahia Biam, he never told me that I'm coming to a big party. He said that there's a little thing I'm having. Uh, as we go from the Moya who's a summit of songs to the place here. That's why I'm not thinking that I'm not supposed to appear like this. Forgive me. I would love to. No you know, you wanted me to dance with you. Yes. Uh, the time I was coming in, yes. I wasn't in the mood now because of the. The lady of the house, thank you very much for the woman, what you do? bringing every person together. We are the coordinator. Thank you. We wish you continued success. Many, many more years of living. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, please, before we have a stage, just one minute. Let's call on uh, his, uh, one of his granddaughters to just, we'll not sing the happy birthday song. Just sing the song. May I call on Lucy, please? Lucy Rogers. Lucy Rogers, the DJ of the Rogers Foundation, and uh, she's still available. She's still available. <laughs> So in case I need money, especially since I left office, I need money. Please, let's welcome you, say Rogers, to repeat in the single Happy Birthday song for you. Good evening, everyone. Um, Your Excellency, my father, Excellency is here present. My father's all present. Before I sing, I just want to say, Uncle Gerald, I call, so it's very interesting, but I actually call Uncle Gerald baby. I know that sounds very weird, but I call him baby because he thinks he's the youngest man in every room. So because of that, I started to call him baby. Um, Uncle Gerald, you're the most amazing person. Your smile, your, our doctor in the house, you know all the medication. Uncle Gerald is always, I don't know where he's, got his medical degree from, I think it's Oboko Medical School, uh, but he always knows the treatment for everything and we love you so much for that. Um, ever since we were in Joss till today, you've always been there, a grandfather, a father, an uncle, a friend, a baby, all of the above. Thank you for being so amazing. We love you and happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy
Well, I started singing Happy Birthday to me. That was when I realized that today is my birthday. And then in the morning, my granddaughter, the one called me, what I had, Happy Birthday, Didi, Grandpa, Happy Birthday. Say, ah, ah, Mommy, how are you? Ask me, fine. So that was when I know that today is my birthday. We went somewhere for um, a Mane Liwanyangu's program, the led Mane Liwanyangu program. So I, I, I was, because I don't normally stay outside by 7 o'clock. So when we entered the Bible with His Excellency and Her Excellency, they were coming to this place. I was worried. So I, let us go back. Now it's night. What are we doing here? So when we came to this place, I saw a lot of cars parked. I was surprised. Uh, let us come back now. There are people here. We might not have any space to stay where we normally stay at the uh, 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 coffee shop there. Uh, when the bank of vehicle, I, I look at the banner they put there. I saw the picture. In fact, in, in fact, I couldn't do the rest like that. I see my my brothers and my friends that I spoke with them this morning, in the morning, no worry. They were coming in. I said, what, what is happening? So, I thank every one of you for honoring this occasion. But I am wishing every one of us here to have this type of wonderful family. We are nine in number. And we, all, we are all living. And uh, we cooperate as usual. Because when we were small, we never share food plate by plate. Whatever it is, if it is rice, they will pour it in a very big tray. We ate. So, we continue with that training that our parents gave to us. And luckily, we have a wonderful wife. <laughs> In the honor of Ujule Mog. I call her my wife. She's everything to this family. Let me tell you, I have never seen a woman like this woman. Her Excellency, uh, come, let me borrow you this uh, moment. Let, 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 let me just borrow your wife for this story. Let me God will continue to bless you. Eh? Eh, God will bless you. God will bless you. You and my children, along with you, all of them, they are wonderful kids. I like what they are doing, the way they behave, the way they take God, the way they treat their parents. I pray Almighty God also, let their children handle them in that way. Thank you. Thank you.